Hey everybody, uh, what's up? How you doing? It's Kane Wolf here. Uh, I'd like to apologize for that last video. I was really kind of all over the frickin' map. Uh, all over the place. Uh, look at all the mob zombies and stuff. So all over the place I was distracted and I was unprepared and it was unacceptable and I apologize for it. Um, just a lot of stuff going on and I really should have just given the video a miss and I didn't and the result was a crappy video. Uh, however, I did finish the smeltery, the first level of it. However, these blocks are going to get removed so that I can show you how I made this stuff over here. I've got enough material I think I can make a couple reserves. I'm going to make one of these casting basins and no, that's the table and the basin. Anyway, whatever they are, I'm going to make uh, one more of each as backups over here and if I've got enough bricks I'm going to put a second layer up, maybe using some uh, glass seared glass bricks. Uh, but I've also got the stuff together so we can make some of our floodlights finally. So we're probably going to do the floodlights first. So moving right along, let's look up the recipe for floodlight. We need a glowing alloy ingot, which is a gold nugget surrounded by glowstone. So let's go over to our handy crafting table. You know what? I'm getting ahead of myself. Getting ahead of myself again. Not thinking things through. I'd know that if I was using my head, but I'm just not. So, and there, glowing alloy ingot. Um. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this should provide l light on the or the dynamic lighting. It does. I can't tell. There's too many torches, and the sun's coming up. Um, but it should. I don't know if it actually does. We'll, f we'll figure that out later. It's really not important. So now we just need two iron, three, gl four iron, sorry, two on each side, three glass, and a redstone. And I'm going to forget that uh, recipe as soon as I open up the thing. Alright. Oh, I've got everything on me except the iron, which is in one of these furnaces. There we go. Once again, unprepared. Uh, sorry. Really not paying attention to what I should be doing lately. Going aloe ingot and a redstone. And now we have a floodlight. Now we can't see whether it, how good it is because the bloody sun's up, but whatever. Now we're going to start over here, I think. We're going to place them on the sta sides of the stairs and have them point out. So. Put it up there. Actually, you know what? Let's get a block. Let's let's take this down. Let's get a block to put behind there and take that out and put the floodlight actually in the staircase. Ideas, I'm having, I'm having them. No, no one can say I'm not having them. Um, they're not good ideas, but they are mine. Put that there. Crack that. I should be able to put it there, no problem. Alright, now we just need uh, something to activate it with. And I think I know just the thing. I know just the thing. I'm gonna get a stick. And I knew there was a reason I smelted extra stone. Now where the hell did I put it? I am so disorganized. There it is. It's a stick and stone, right? It's not cobblestone. If it's cobblestone, I just end this video now and restart everything. Yeah, it's cobblestone, isn't it? God damn it. Why don't any of you s stop me before I do something stupid? Like, really? You know what? Well, then screw it. I've got the redstone on me. Let's just use a redstone bloody torch. Um, bam. There. Sorted. We'll replace this with a lever later so that we can... Oh, no. Do I have to place it on it? Redstone signal should work, right? Um, apparently not. Okay, so I do have to make a lever. Um, so I need more cobble. God. It's always something with you people, isn't it? Not, <laughs> not even gonna go, go down to the proper mine. Just, there. It's, it's done, I got a piece of cobble. If this doesn't work, I'm gonna rage quit all, all up in here. 
A lot of rage quitting going on. There we go. Can't see how effective it is because, well, there's no, there's nothing here. Um. We're actually gonna put that there because we're gonna put our other one facing this way here. We're gonna take this out, I think, and maybe integrate it somewhere else. But for now, it can stay there, I guess. So we need another glowing alloy ingot. Yes, yes, we do. So, do to do, do, forgetting what I'm doing again. Which is always a good sign. Let's go ahead and make two of them. We are gonna need two of them. So both of these should run off the one switch, uh, if I've done this properly. There we go, and that sh this should light up the entire downstairs area. Actually, I should have made a couple more, because I want one for this hallway. I'll probably plant it there, light up this room, this hallway, I want one for upstairs. But most importantly, because these do something very special, I want one out here keep light on my crops. But this one can be mounted like that. It doesn't need uh, the super ridiculous set in the wall thing. Although, yeah, you know what it does? It, it needs to be super ridiculous. If we're doing this, why, why are we doing it if not to be ridiculous? But that means I need some more cobble for that, and I need to make a few more floodlights. But we don't even know how effective they are, so let's take a break from that, and I'll show you how I did all this. If, once again, I can remember where I put all my goddamn materials. There we go, seared bricks, seared bricks, seared bricks. Well, let's just sort this out. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Now let's see if I can do this from memory. Um, probably not the best idea. So we're going to take these out. We're breaking our smeltery, we know it's broken because this is going to go away. It won't let us actually access it right now. This will have to come out one more, won't it? Oh, whatever. Whatever. Who cares? I certainly do not. So, we need two drains. which you make like that. We need two faucets, which you make like that. We're going to replace one with a seared brick, so that we're going to leave the one seared brick there, that's fine. Now, we need, what do we need? We need a basin, which is that, and we need a casting table which is like that. I'm going to take that back. That guy better not have teleported in my house somewhere, and he better not be messing my garden up. I'll be so angry. Alright, so what we do, we take the drains, we stick them on the floor here, then you put your faucets on the drains, and down here, Ba -ba -da -ba -da. We put our casting table, and over here, our basin. Now the casting table is used to make the uh, brass, or the bronze castings, and fill them with, you put your bronze casting in, you fill it with liquid, and it basically makes a tool of that material. This whole thing is designed so that you put lava in here as fuel, you put your metal into it, and it'll melt your ores down, and you'll have a liquid version of that metal. Then you take the uh, stone tool parts that you made here, you stick them on the black blank casting table, 
make sure you've got, uh, I think it's tin and aluminum, or something, aluminum and bronze or something. It's some ratio. I can look it up in the book in a minute, because we're going to have to go hunting for that stuff as well as more lava. You get aluminum brass, because it combines as a liquid in the thing. You get aluminum brass, you pour it over your stone thing, you let it harden, it makes a casting plate. You take your casting plate, you put it back in the thing, you say melt some iron or gold or whatever, you pour that into the shape, and it'll make the uh, tool you need. So it's really quite simple uh, once we get into the operation of it. But we need lava. I've only got one book bucket of lava, but we can go to the nether for lava. It's pretty easy to get. What we really need to get done is all these tool parts in stone, which means we'll need more cobble. But since we pretty much need more cobble anyway to make levers for... Ugh. To make levers for our uh, floodlights, I think it's time to end this video while I go mine some goddamn cobble. Um, don't forget to like or subscribe. Uh, I'm sorry about the, uh, all over the place this video, these videos. Um, all I can say is my defense is half the time I'm relearning stuff I'd forgotten, or learning stuff I didn't know about from the mods. So, I'm learning along with you, and a lot of the times I'm relearning stuff that I've done once, and it doesn't come back to me quite as well as I would hope. Anyway, don't forget to like or subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Bye!